so okay. pretty. Okay. Yeah? You too. You're not looking bad as well. Oh, thank you. Your shirt. Your shirt. Oh. <laughs> you are saying Sierra Leone for life. Yeah. I live and die Sierra Leone. I'm saying the land that we love. Sierra One Leone. Africa. One love. I am my, uh, How are you doing? So how's your day going? I'm so hungry. Oh my gosh. You know, I was fasting the whole of yesterday because you told me that we need to try authentic. Exactly. It's one of the most amazing dishes and you definitely don't want to Do you know skip the thing out. You know I love so much in my entire life? What is that? Food. Mmm, foodie. You know, watch my videos knows that I love food more than women. <laughs> Oh. Exactly. So you know what we're gonna do? Mm -hmm. Just I wanna eat. So I, I'm so hungry. Like it's six o'clock. I need to eat. Maya, Just you're in the right place. Breakfast. Exactly. We're gonna have breakfast like right now. Ready? With me. You see how hungry I am. <laughs> Let's go. All right, welcome to Hotel Africanos. This is like the best place you could find local dishes in Sierra Leone. Wow. The CEO is owned by Nasser Ayub, one of the greatest musicians. And then he opened this amazing place. As you can see, everything is culture. It's everything beautiful. is kind of like vibing with the African vibe, if you know uh, what African I mean. Africanos means African? Yeah, it's a combination of different national. Like, it just doesn't limit Sierra Leoneans okay. around. Okay. It's reasonable, it's affordable, it's very comfortable. Right. so homey thank you so much yes where's my food thank oh you. your food is in the can oh, my food. oh someone said hi how are you uh, how do you body fine uh, fine body talk the creole with her talk the creole with her i, I just speak creole so so okay, i don't know i just talk a sabi talk creole okay how you do uh, i'm welcome my son thank you hey thank you all right <laughs> thank you <laughs> you got it right so we're gonna show yeah, well, us very yes good. Mm. Where's the food? I'm so hungry. So the food oh, is right here. Oh, yes. Oh, special for the Maya. I for mean, Maya. When I told them, they were like, oh my gosh, we have to, you know, you know, we give the best to anybody coming from Sierra Leone. And wow. then they were like, the best food you could eat literally is Pemai. And of course, we have Lafidi, which is like two cores. So you're hungry, right? You're going to eat two. I, I, I'm so hungry, but I need breakfast. This is breakfast in Sierra Leone. Literally, this is what you eat in the morning because sometimes the kind of work you're doing, you need to eat something that you wouldn't, you know, be cutting on snacks. This will give you blood you know, and like energy. Wow. The and last all that. time I ate this heavy in the morning, I slept the whole day. <laughs> Trust me, you're not going to sleep. It's going to give you more energy. energy. Exactly. Ooh. So now we're gonna have yeah. some. Where are we sitting? So you're gonna sit over here by my side. Oh, oh of course. You <laughs> sit beside a queen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> do anything for the food. Yeah. Anything for the food. Wow. The good thing about this food is everything is made like plants. Everything is growing. Nothing, you know, chemical. Mm. No storage. No, not no frozen foods. No nothing. Mm. Everything is from the plant. As you can see, there is like. A lot of ingredients and here that are super it. healthy. Thank you. Yes. So we're gonna start oh, first with the rice. Sir. You know come rice, close. right? Of course. From the stash. It's, it's not new. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have some. But before we get that, let me just quickly explain. Okay, this is pie mine. This mm -hmm. is like the most famous food from our ancestors up to now. It's still people are eating it. For what? Pemai. Pemai. Pemau. Pemau. Yes. Pemau. Pemau. <laughs> Something like that. Yes. Pem. 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 <laughs> Oh uh, after you eat, I promise you, you're going to pronounce it very good. Pemau. Pemau. Okay, next time. We're gonna, I'm gonna pronounce it next time. What is it made of? Okay, we have here petata leaf. Okay. And then, uh, firstly, when you cook the rice, when it's like almost about to like get dry, you put the petata leaf on top of it and then you cover it. Okay. The steam will help it like soften it and kind of like cooking okay. it. So when you're done, you kind of like at the side, like you have jacato, you know, mm -hmm. eggplants. Mm -hmm. Jacato, you have pepper, and then you have hoggery. Hoggery is like um, benny. Okay. Benny. Yes, you put it inside and kind of like steam, 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 steam. Wow. When it finishes steaming, you remove it from the water and like allow it to dry a little bit. And then you come with another pot, which you use is the red pamai. That's pamai. Yes. It's red oil, right? Eh? Red oil, yes. We call it pamai. Uh, pamai. Yeah, red oil. Oh. So you use this to warm it, kind of like allow it to warm in the fire. And then when it's done, you kind of like mix the whole ingredients with the leaf. You take the leaf from the I rice. I would love to see and then where we can see how they do this. Oh yes, next vlog, I'm definitely gonna show you. So I'm just gonna okay. show you quickly the ingredients. Okay. This is going to be used in the lafidi. 
which is going to be so tasty. Wow. And uh, this is a uh, pepper. This is something like that. Okay. We kind of like used it in. Okay. Yeah. And then we have, last but not the least, it's the jacato. This mm. is the jacato. Is it garden next? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Exactly. Wow. So these are a few of the things that they kind of like use to get this. Oh, then add the red oil to yes. with the potato leaves mm -hmm. and it's, and oh, that's okay. it. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. So she's saying that these are the ingredients that they used to prepare this, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So together with this, together with the potato leaves, and then to so no tomato in this one. No. No tomato. No tomato. Mm -hmm. wow. That's amazing. Like, it is, are we done? Yeah, we're done with the explanation Thank now. Thank you so much. So let's, Thank you so much. Let me just do the pleasure to serve you. Thank you. Would you allow me? Thank you. <laughs> Definitely. Okay, so let's get you some. You said you're hungry, so I'm going to give hungry. you. I really don't need small rice. Please mm. give me plenty of rice now. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to use this now to put the sauce. Trust me, you're going to love it. It's so... And they said that this gives you like enough blood mm. for the ones that are kind of like sick. This is what they prepare for them mostly because oh, wow. everything is like natural and plant-based, you know? Oh, wow. So taste that first and then you want me to add more? No, oh, it's okay. I mean, yeah, good. Mm -hmm. So take the first bite. Since so we're already cook your leaves, eh? Mm. Ah, cook. Oh, oh, potato or cocoyam? No, it's potato. Oh, wow. We call it petete leaf. Petete leaves. Yes. Guys, you see how the combination is? Yeah, and the smell, the hogri you know, scent. The aroma. It's mm. called hogri. The, hogri. the one that makes the smell like mm. deadly. It's called hogri. Mmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. So, how do you see it? Oh, this is so tasty. Very, very tasty. Anytime That's I go to my mom, spicy, yeah? a bit spicy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Lafibi is more spicier and more yeah. tasty. Exactly. Thank you. So, you want to taste the Sarah juice? Sarah juice? Yes. We have an amazing juice made in Sierra Leone called made in Sierra Leone. Sierra, Yeah, Sarah juice. Wow. So, do you guys have Sierra juice? I would, I would love to. I understand what people were saying that you're missing a lot if you don't eat potato leaves with rice. Mm. Definitely. It, it really tastes good. Exactly. Very spicy. Mm -hmm. The aroma alone, I think, can satisfy you. Yeah, I know. The red oil, you know, and it got everything. It got like protein. There's no protein. I don't see fish. No fish. No Usually fish. they can put some fish, like um, there's something called dry rice, like the, I mean dry fish. Okay. The raw fish, they take it and like they put it on the banga, okay. like on top of the fire and kind of allow it to yeah, dry. dry yeah. And then they can put it, they can mix it together. But since we want to eat like the original one, because if you kind of like put fish in it, it's kind of like to give it a more taste. Yes. But I want us to start this way oh, okay. since it's more yeah. like in it. We just had our first one, which is the pemao. Okay. Very tasty. You can attest to it. He was exactly. looking I on his so plate. Much. I finished it. They have to clean the plate and bring me. Exactly. So now we're gonna move on to breakfast number two. Breakfast number this one two. is amazing. It's called lafidi, but we call it dry rice dry since rice. it's literally almost like cook, but not cook, but it's still cook. This is the cereal. Yes, this is the cereal juice. Natural juice. Exactly. Shake it up. Oh, shake it up. Oh, sorry. Shake sorry, it up. Sorry. Shake it up. Honest. You want all the, you know, pineapple mix up. Oh, you know, it's really oh, nice. Wow. The factory is here. Literally, they do everything here. And um, it's very reasonable. It's literally everywhere. I know it's in uh, Liberia. Mm. It's in Ghana. I mean, Guinea, because Guinea. it's our neighboring country. So, how does it oh. taste? You need this mm. for a whole day. Yeah. Like, I love pineapple juice, and I think this is the best one I've ever tasted. Oh, really? So now we're going to move over. Give me the other opportunity for me to be your server. No problem. All right. So literally, let me just explain it quickly. So here, over here in dry rice, everything is just basically the same, like this one, but not actually like this one. Mm -hmm. You get to mix it yourself. As for this one, the first one that we ate, the pamao, okay. it's mixed while you're cooking it, you know, cooked after the process, you right. you mix it. Mm -hmm. But over the second one, which is the lafidi, you have to literally do it yourself. Wow. Yes, oh, yes. Okay. And it's very nice because 
if you mix it and then you can't finish it, you can just leave this in the freezer and you can eat it the next morning. Mm. Yes, it's really nice. Amazing. So over here we have um, pepper, of course, and then we have uh, jagato. You're very yeah, affair. Yes, okay. yes. So we call it jakato. Talk about jakato. Oh, 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 oh. Then we have, of course, my favorite okra. Oh, okra. Oh, okra oh, is really, really nice. So this helps kind of like blend it in the rice. You wow. can, it's either you can do it two way. You can mix it with the rice, or then you can put it on top, you know, and all that. Mm. So first off, we're gonna be. Oh, same rice. So of course, you know, this one is a bit spicy, like the other one, but this one is more spicier because you get to. Eat the rawness of the you know pepper so yeah thank you so i forgot to introduce this one for those oh, wow. who know you can't the sadi is never complete without the fish you either eat it with a raw fish or like fried fish but this one is kind of like sardi it's sardi. really healthy it's really nice put it in. no that one is the last one you put oh, okay so the first one is this one so you put this one on top not too much. Okay. And then you take the pepper. Oh wow. You put it on the side. So everything is gonna be side by side, you know? Interesting, right? Yeah, very interesting. Like I'm literally learning a lot. Yeah. You, you have to. At least I'm, we're teaching you something that you can go back to, you know, yeah. and tell your people, wow, salon food is fine. And then we have we put a little bit of okra. It gives it that taste, you know. And then we have some jumbo maggi. Mm, I forgot to mention this. Okay, I think we have to find the jumbo maggi. Okay. The jum oh, there you are. Hmm. Yeah, it was hiding on me. So we have to open it up. So this is like jumbo maggi, okay. like the one that you used to cook with cool. it. But this one is kind of like um, very nice. You could even lick it or like eat it with the rice. So this one you use it as the spice. You understand? It's kind of strange to you, right? Exactly, because the maggi, I know you have to cook it. Cook it. But no, this one it serves as the salt because it, this one is mixed with salt and a bit of like um, the seasoning, every combination of it. And then you have to put it like a little piece of it and then you grind it on top. Let's see how beautiful it looks. Oh, wow. I swear you're going to love it, trust me. So yeah, you just put a tiny bit some more and then yeah. So there's a lot of things you can add to with the lafiti. You can just put beni. You know beni, right? Beni. Beni. What's beni? Beni is like um, the grind. Um, how do they call it again? Then we have something like uh, again uh, kenda. Those are like the traditional oh, wow. stuffs oh, that you can feed grind, it, and then you put grind, it on oh, top. Okay, okay. And then last but not the least is the sari itself. You put it on top. Mm. Then then you can use the sari oil a little bit. Yeah. All right. So last but not the least, of course, the pamad. You're gonna put tiny bits of it so because you're literally making a whole new stew. Exactly. That's why it's called dry rice because you literally do it like. Hmm. I have to say it's like when you're you're alive and then you're removing your guts. That kind of way, you know. Like doing everything raw ah, by I yourself. See. It's like you're cooking. I see. Yes. So then you put a little bit of parma. See how colorful and cute it looks like? Basically, this is what a lot of people eat, especially the Fula, Fulani people. The Fulani in the morning? People. In the morning. They kind of like do it a lot. And then when guests come, this is what they eat. And you know, it's very reasonable, affordable, and it fills your belly, honestly. So this is your spoon. Take the pleasure of taking the first bite. Your, your <laughs> I'm scared. I'm literally, I'm literally scared. This is new to you, this right? This is new to me. This I, is I, I, new. I've eaten a lot of things, but hey, this, this is new. This is new. All right, so um, you're gonna eat it with a fork. Oh, you need to use the spoon. Yes, I want you to take the with biggest. The, with a hand. Oh my god, you want to eat it with a hand? Of course. Oh my god, bring pot. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my Jahan. god. So literally, when you want to start, you take bits by bits, pepper and the fish. You mix it, mix it, mix it, then you jump on. Eat them. So we have the water here. Thank you. Hmm. I need to wash my hands. Wash your hand and eat some food. 
Yeah, thank you. All right, thank, thank you. you so much. All right. So I'll go this way. Okay, so you Definitely. take half everywhere. Okay. You take pepper, pepper. and then you take jagato. Then you take okra. okra. Oh yeah. my god, it's very then slimy. A little bit of fish. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, Jesus. you mix it up. You mix it up. Then you jump on. Do you need some Maggie in it? How does it taste? What? You're smiling. What? Tell me something. What? Hold on, I'm gonna tell you something. <laughs> One more time. Okay, okay, okay. Let me not piss. One more time. The hell out of you! I just, I just want to know your reaction. What? Can I tell you that? What? This is what I've been missing my whole life. <laughs> yes! Oh! Like, I was literally scared of frying this. Yeah, right. But it's so delicious. Like, I know. The combination alone. Exactly. You know, you have a little bit of garden eggs together with the maggi alone. Maggi alone, it's right? Maggi. Mm -hmm. Get out the sardine. Mm -hmm. Lord Jesus. Don't worry, let me just add some more. Wow. Wow. Mm. Who, who, who came up with this combination? <laughs> Sierra Leone people, then. But this is probably, like, a lot of people eat the full egg people mm. the Fulanese eat this a lot like every day they can eat it with country rice we have our own country rice where we okay. grow it it's really really nice, really nice. you should try that oh, you know this is so nice. Mm -hmm. this is so nice. I want to tell you guys that this is just breakfast this is just breakfast and you it's guys really shocking man it's super shocking in a nice way it's <laughs> nice <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Everything is, that, is funny. It's just shocking in a nice way. <laughs> shocking, like some people. Like, are you eating that? No, but it's, oh, you're eating that. Yeah, Excited, you know. If you ever visit Sierra Leone, this is the best meal you need to eat for breakfast. And don't forget that I got this meal at what Hotel Africanos. Africanos. But what's your name again? Amina Kone. And what's the name of your YouTube channel? Miss Amina Inspiring Moment. Wow, that's a long name, but hey, I'm gonna put a uh, YouTube link in the description box. Make sure you go check it out and uh, subscribe to support her. This is how we do it. And um, <laughs> God damn it, I need to. <laughs> okay. This is really spicy. I know, right? Thank you so much. No problem. And um, I'm gonna see you in the next one, yeah? Sure, we have lots of places to go and catch up. I am Maya. Maya.